All right, friends. So we are going to learn something new today. I'm going to teach you three words that you're going to be able to read, write, and spell. All right. And then you're going to use those words to make and read your very own sentences. It's going to be easy, I promise. You're going to love it. So the first word I'm going to teach you, get ready, get ready, is this word. Yes, it's an I. You're right. I is an incredibly special, special letter because I is a letter, I is a vowel, and I is a word. It is a word. We use this word probably in our language, in our very own talking, probably 200 times a day. Maybe even more if you're an extra special chatterbox. Are you a chatterbox? Probably are. So, what do you mean? I've never used that word before. Yes, you have. You use this word every time you say, I love you. What did I say first? I. You use this word when you ask for something like, can I have a drink of water? Can I have a snack? Can I call grandma? Okay, so you use this word when you're talking about yourself, when you are asking a question for yourself, okay? We don't say, um, we don't say Elizabeth love you, because yes, my name is Elizabeth, or Mrs. Lewis love you. No, and we don't say me love you. No, we say I love you. We don't say me have a snack please? No. You don't say me have a snack please. You say I would like a snack please. Okay? So this is the word I. Yes it is a letter. Sometimes it's a letter. It's a vowel. But right now, right here, it is the word I. Okay? It is a word. And it is the word we use when we are talking about ourselves. So, oh! My board just fell down. Okay, so I'm gonna put that up. Ah! You can still see, right? Okay, it's still there. I, it's on the board. All right, here's the next word. Ready? Say S. E E S E E This is the word C Say C I see you What do we do with our eyes? We see we see with our eyes. Okay? Our eyes see the world for us, okay? Say S-E-E, -E. see. I see a hat right there, a hat, okay? See, say it again, S-E-E, -E. see. This is to talk about something that you see. Okay? So that is the next word going up on my board that's falling down on me. Okay? Now we have I see. Hmm. I wonder where I'm going next. You ready for the next word? This one's gonna blow your mind too. A. Say A. Yeah, just say A. It's a 
lot like I in the sense that this is a letter, this is a vowel, but it's also a word. Okay? Say A. Okay? How do you spell A? A. Yes, it's that easy. How do you spell A? A. Okay. Now, on my window right in front of me there. So this is what I'm going to do. I only have a brown marker. It doesn't matter. I did this today with all black expo outside with the kids. We got the idea. So I'm just going to draw a quick picture and then we're going to read. Yes, we're going to read. Okay. I drew a very quick picture. I'll put it on the board. There it is. Yes, it's a tree. Good. I already hear you saying, oh, it's a tree. Now we have to read. When we read, we always read from left to right. I would also like you to notice that I have purposefully written my letters and my words in the middle of my card. So that way, in between each word, there's a nice space. And then here's C. And then here's a nice space of nothing. And then there's an A. And then there's a nice space of nothing. Oh, and I cannot forget this, which I'm going to show you in a second. Okay. So, mustn't forget the punctuation mark. It's a period. Always put a punctuation mark at the end of the sentence. So, because I used my spaces, I know exactly how many words are in my sentence. One, two, three, and this is a word too. I just didn't write it, I drew it. Okay? Because I wanted you to read it. I just taught you these three words. You can read that one by reading the picture. That's reading two. And then we have our punctuation mark. So how many words will be in this sentence? One, two, three, four. Okay? All right, let's read. What is this word again? I see a tree. Done. Go ahead, do it again. I see a tree. Perfect. Now, I don't want you going, I see a tree. I see a tree. I don't want you looking at me either when you're doing this reading. Your eyes need to be looking at the word when you're saying the word. So that means you should be moving your eyes along with my finger. Okay? Because if I mix up these, these word cards and I say, okay, put the sentence back in order. If you've been looking at me the whole time, and not looking at these words, you're not going to have any idea where to put your words. Okay, what word goes first? I, then what? C, then what? A, tree. All right, let's do another one. Ready? What is it? I, good. Sorry. I'm not really good at using my left hand. What's this word? C. What's this word? A. Sometimes kids will say a. Uh. And that's okay, like if you read it that way, if you say, I see a tree, we say that all the time, so I'm not going to tell you you can't do that. But 
when I say, what is this word, I don't want you to say a, uh, I want you to say a. If you're reading in a sentence and you say a, uh, that's a little bit different. But when I show you this word all by itself, I want you to say a. Because really, what letter says a? Uh? You. Okay? So this is A. Alright. Draw another picture for you. Hmm. Oh, this is gonna be cute. Do 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 do. Okay, ready? What is it? Yes, it's a caterpillar. I know, I'm not that great at the drawing of that. I'm not a fantastic illustrator, but I try. Don't let me forget my punctuation. All right, you ready to read to me? Go. I see a caterpillar. Read it again. I see a caterpillar. Good. Well, that was good. I heard your smooth reading right there. Now read it by yourself. Beautiful. Now you might be thinking, okay, well, it's my job. Well, your job is to take pieces of paper. I actually just took index cards and cut them in half. If you have index cards, perfect. You can also use post-its. Have your adult help you write the words I, C, A, okay? One on each card, just like I did. And it's going to be your job to go outside in your yard and, and, and build your sentence just like I did here. And then maybe if you found a pine cone, put a pine cone right there with a period. I see a pine cone, period, okay? Make, mm, build five sentences. One, two, three, four, five. A whole hand. I only did two. One, two. I want you to do five with five different objects. A leaf, uh, a stick, um, pine cones, whatever. I see a weed. I see a flower. Um, put it in your sentence, snap a photo of it. I would love to hear you reading your sentences and put it on Seesaw. Okay? That's your job. Have fun.